When using tables, Excel gives you an option of adding a total row. By default, Excel tables do not have total rows, but one can easily be added. To add a total row to an Excel table, follow these steps. Step 1. Select a cell in your Excel table. Step 2. Click on the Design Contextual tab. Step 3. Locate the Table Style Options group. Step 4. Check the box labeled Total Row, and now your Excel table will have a total row in the very last row of the table. If you activate a cell located in the total row, you will notice that there is a drop down menu. This drop down menu offers you options of different functions that you can apply to each column of data within your table. For qualitative data, this feature would not be useful, but for most quantitative data, it could be. For example, we've used a sum formula to find the total value of all real estate listings on the market. As you can see, there are many different formulas available to use and this is much more efficient than having to manually enter in formulas. You just need to be sure that the formula you use makes sense. For example, it wouldn't make sense to use a sum formula for the street numbers. Even though street numbers are numeric values, they are still categorized as qualitative data. Note, if you entered in a formula that referred to a value in the total row, the result would return an error when the total row is hidden. If the total row was unhidden, then the formula would work again.